Today we have uh, about 220 students uh, from uh, 26 schools across the province participating in science fair. Now these students have won their, their school-based science fair, so with 220 students here today, there would be literally thousands of students that would be doing science fair projects in the education system. A number of the scientific questions that students are asking themselves are things that we're hearing in the media. So important issues of the day, the quality of our groundwater, uh, bullying and the psychological effects of bullying, how we can develop uh, uh, new energy sources on Prince Edward Island. So, so themes sort of emerge based on what people are talking about in communities. So it's great to see those projects here. My project is based on groundwater because lately there's been a lot of talk about groundwater in the media and I decided that I'd do something relative to groundwater. For my experiment I had to construct a model of an aquifer and it's basically like a bottle and it has rocks. They only go up to a certain layer and my experiment was to test whether height differential, like depth of the hole that the water could go out, would affect the amount of water that would come out in a certain amount of time. I'm sure you heard the saying, an apple a day keeps the doctor away, or carrots are very good for your eyes. But did you ever wonder why? Do you think that a denser fruit is better for you? Well, that's what I'm trying to find out my project. And now my hypothesis was incorrect. The more denser a fruit is does not necessarily mean that it has a higher nutrition value. It's pretty fun to do the science fair because you learn a lot and it's, there's always something new you can do. You can go one step further from your project every time. And that entire science fair journey from start to end uh, really helps students develop uh, uh, very important uh, skills that they need to be successful when they get out of school and they go into whatever career they choose uh, to pursue. We talk about critical thinking skills, problem solving skills, uh, communication skills. I mean these skills are very important no matter what field of study you want to get into, what, no matter what career you're interested in. You need to be able to think on your feet. You need to be able to uh, engage uh, people in your community or in your, in your workplace and communicate your ideas. And that's really what Science Fair is all about.